Why am I broke? Because guess what? You on Amazon, you on TikTok shop, you on Fashion Nova. I'm buying stuff I can't fit. To think it, oh, you're going to lose some weight, so go ahead and get it now. So you can now take your PTO. I don't care if it's for a mental health day. Take your PTO and lay in your bed. It's going straight through, and I'm just going to put it in there. One, period. And But let me show y'all something. So you undo it, and then it comes. But I'm going to do a little lash. <laughs> okay, we love a little lash now. I'm big. Lose weight. Y'all, these are the glasses and I got the little blue. Dollars. I got a, uh, hold on. An extra large. channel where i do it for the big fine woman that's on period like comment and subscribe and let's jump into this new video okay y'all this is a home body vlog okay i don't have nowhere to go i just have to work and work and work because it's our peak season once again and as you can tell i work from home if you knew her i've been working from home for eight eight and a half years almost nine why I got my hair scarf on and my pajamas. Y'all took them braids down. I had to. I had to wash my scalp. That weave was irritating my scalp, so I just had to wash and get that weave out. And you know what I'm saying? I put some flat twist in my hair with some grease on my scalp. Oh my god, I felt so good. Put my scarf on. That's why I'm looking like this. Okay, y'all will not be seeing my hair till Sunday, I believe. Because I don't have nowhere to go. I gotta work this weekend, so I will be looking. Probably like this for the next three days. Y'all, it is 7, 7.50 a.m. I'm working in the living room because, well, the dining room, because I just needed to break out of my room. It was cluttered by my vanity. I was like, okay, I just need a little break. So that's why I am in here. Uh, I got my heater going if y'all hear some noise because I be getting cold. If you work from home, you already know. I don't know. I just be getting cold. So I have my little heater on my feet. It feels so good. Yeah, I am not blind. I ordered these UV blue light sunglasses because I work from home, of course, and I stir the screen all day. I can stir the screen for 13 hours, literally, y'all. Because sometimes I work 12 hours and I be on my phone. I watch YouTube. I watch TV. So I was like, dang, I do need. No, my boyfriend told me, uh, I might need to order some of these glasses so they can protect my eyes because I was straining them and it, that was causing a headache with me doing that. So sometimes watching the computer all day can mess with your head too, like cause headaches and all that stuff. So I was like, no, okay, let me get the sunglasses. So I ended up getting these. Um, speaking of TikTok shop, my little cup that I got, oh my God. I love this cup, y'all. I love this cup. I don't know what's something about it. Plus, it holds a lot of water, so just for me to drink on while I work. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel fancy. I feel real fancy when I have that cup. So, I love that. TikTok shop is something else. I'm done with them, though. I'm tired of spending my money, okay? And here I am always talking about, why am I broke? Why am I broke? Because guess what? You on Amazon, you on TikTok shop, you on Fashion Nova. I'm buying stuff I can't fit. Thinking, oh, you're gonna lose some weight, so go on ahead and get it now so you can wear it later. Uh uh, no, ma'am, I'm not buying nothing else, okay, until I lose 30 pounds. I need to lose 30 pounds, y'all. That is the goal this year. I need to lose 30 pounds, okay, and that's what I'm going to do. 
So yeah, y'all. So that's what I'm doing. I'm just working, work, work, work. That's all I know. And that's a problem. We got to talk about that. It's a shame how much I work. I work like I have three kids. I'm not going to lie to y'all. And that's a good thing, but that can be a bad thing too. Because why am I working so much? And I get it. You know, you want to stack your money, stack your money, stack your money. But at the same time, it's like I'm exhausted. I miss things. I miss events. I'm that auntie, y'all, like, I miss out on things because I'm working. I didn't realize that until a couple months ago. Last year, sometime, I was just like, I missed out on so many things because I had to work. And it wasn't like, I had to work because I had bills, but at the same time, I could have took PTO. I could have took days off. I was I was kind of raised, you know, we don't miss work over here. You know, you go to work, you use PTO if you're on vacation. You know, you got to town. But now that I'm knowing, no, take your PTO. I don't care if it's for a mental health day. Take that PTO and lay in your bed. Take that PTO to clean your house. Take that PTO to drive to Nashville. I don't care. Take that PTO, y'all, because you'll end up regretting it like me. I'm not going to lie. That's... I'm not going to say it's a big regret, but it's like a mistake that I made. Let me say that from overworking myself because I will work where I will take work home. Even though I work from home, I will log off and I will still think about work. Like, dang, I got to do this tomorrow. I got to do that. I got to do this. We're not doing it no more. They will figure it out, okay? Just like if they fired you, they have somebody else in your chair tomorrow. They will figure it out, okay? So, I had to realize that it took me a long time to realize that. Because I have been with this company almost nine years. So, it took me a while to realize I don't have to work that hard. God will figure it out for me. You know, do your part. Now, God don't, he didn't say be lazy. You know, but he still said take care of yourself. You know, he still said worry about, you know, go see your family. Be around loved ones, you know. He still wants you to do that, y'all, you know. So, I just feel like I can't keep living my life like this. I have missed out so much from my brothers. My brothers play sports and stuff. I work, like, my little brothers. I'm the oldest. I worked a lot, y'all. Like, when I say I worked a lot, and it just hit me last year. Like, dang, is it really worth missing a lot of big moments? I don't think it is. It's not worth miss, missing no big moments, y'all. It's really not. And I know in that moment, you be like, I got to get this money. I got to get this money on. That's what they saying. And you do. But it can come about other ways as well. So this is why I'm trying to work hard and get other revenues going, especially my candle business, YouTube. I need something else as well because I don't want to work for somebody forever. I want that financial freedom. I want that time. And if I have kids, or when I have kids, I want to be able to take off and be with my kid. You know, the first six months. I don't know. You know, I, I, I'm not a mother, so I don't know how it goes for real. But in my mind, I would like that. I would like to be able to spend time with my child, uh, my husband, and all that stuff. That's where I'm at now. I'm 31. I will be 32 in September. I can't. I worked, y'all. I worked. I did my time. I did my time. That's all I'm going to say. I don't have no much. I'm tired. Y'all ain't y'all tired? And they talking about black folks don't want to work. Hell, we don't work all our lives. Shit, I'm tired. I'm 30 and I'm tired. So y'all want me to work till I'm 75 years old. Get up out of here. Bye. Now, granted, you still got to, you know, have your little income. You did. You still got to work somewhere, but working for somebody, which my job, I'm not going to lie. I'm all right. You know, I'm all right. You know, man. I ain't looking all right over here. You know, but could it be better? Yeah. Uh, could I work for myself? Yeah. Uh, speaking on that. When I watch YouTube, seeing young ladies working for themselves, it is so inspiring. Seeing um, 
seeing young ladies, uh, even ladies my age, older, traveling, that black luxury. I love seeing it, so I love when women post these things because we need to see, especially black women. And I'm speaking from this perspective because I'm a black woman, you know. So, yeah, I love seeing black women living luxury lives. And it's not always about making the most money. I'm just saying to be able to take off just because you can take off. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to report to nobody. You don't got to ask nobody nothing. And that's not a bad thing either, y'all. I'm just, the place in my life right now is, I want to work for me eventually. And that will be coming, you know. And I want that freedom. I want that. That's a luxury within itself. Financial freedom is a very much luxury. I don't care about the cars. I don't. Cars come and go. And that's it, it. Cars come and go. And let's be honest. The cars that's here now, it's not really worth the money. If we're going to keep it a buck. Unless you get one of them. I don't know. You know, fancy cars, I guess. I guess. But yeah, so. It's just about financial freedom. I want. I want the the choice to be able to say, oh, let's go to Cancun tomorrow. Let's go to Bora Bora Tuesday. Let's just fly out. Let's go to Japan. I don't know. I want to see the world. Even that, I think about my 20s, like, I didn't travel as much as I should. And I had the money. Like, I had definitely had the funds. I didn't travel a lot. I worked. I went back to school after I dropped out. Got my degree and work and work and work. That's all I have done is work. That is, it's kind of sad and it's like, dang, I'm blessed. Honestly, I am blessed. But at the same time, it's like, dang, what was I doing? I didn't have no kids. Well, I don't have no kids. I had all the bread now. Shit is high. But back, I had money, y'all. Even when I look back, I'm like, what the hell was I doing? <laughs> it's not funny, but it is. Because what was I doing with my money? No more. No more this year. I, I'm showing up for me, y'all. And even now, I'm not working. I was working 12 hours. I'm now shut myself down to 10 hours for my OT days. 10 hours, even though I love my 12 because I get that extra money. But it's like, you need to take care of yourself. Is it really worth it? And now it's like, I even had to question myself with my relationship with God because I'm like, dang, I'm showing up for this job almost every day, but I, I'm giving God the bare minimum. That's a problem for me. That's a really big problem. And I have to make the change now. You know, and... Um, because my relationship with God is very serious. It is very, very serious to me. And I just don't like that I'm giving this job so much of my time. So much of my time. And I'm really doing that for God. Or if I do give it, you know, give my time to God, it's, it's not as long as I would like. 30 minutes, but I'm, I'm right here 10 hours. Mm -mm. No, ma'am. No, ma'am. We got to change that, y'all. We can't be playing. God has been too good, okay? Can we talk about it? God has been way too good to me, especially when I didn't deserve it. And I'm not going to get emotional because when I think about it, it just, it's, uh, but yeah. y'all what's up oh my god i have not been back on her yesterday i worked all day then i had to go to the grocery store get some groceries y'all it is saturday okay so of course i'm working as y'all can tell so today i need to soak my weave uh, that i got my braid in her i'm gonna clean it because y'all know i don't know when i did my braids last time my scalp was like itching really bad it was flaking up i don't know what was going on so 
I watched the video on TikTok, how to wash your little weave. So I'm gonna soak it in ACV, uh, apple cider vinegar first, and then I'm gonna wash it with some shampoo. So I'm gonna do that today because I'm gonna braid my hair next week and I need that weave to be dry and you know, all that good stuff. So I'm gonna do that today. Yeah, so I forgot to show y'all, if you watched my last video, I, um, me and my family, you know, redid the storage room slash office. So we did that and we made like a mini little gym area, like very mini. Okay, so I gotta show y'all that. I forgot to show y'all. Okay, so this is the little gym area. We got our, uh, everything right here. There go my gloves, y'all. Um, weights, more weights. I got my waist trainer, my yoga mat, and then I got the bike. So this is our little workout area. Don't judge us. We trying to get in shape, and that's what we do. Oh, yeah. Yeah, so I got the stepper. I love it. It's a beast. It is a beast. It even got these little, um, hold on, yeah. It got these little, what is these, like, arm things? I don't know, for your arms and stuff. Y'all beast. So, I got that. So, yeah, we got our workout area. We trying to get into the bag, okay? So, we got the gym area together. So, that worked out. So, I've been working out at home, and then I've been walking since it's been a little warmer. So, we love that for us. I have to soak this weave, so I'm about to do that now. And then, y'all know tomorrow's Easter, so... I'm not cooking, I'm not doing nothing, cause guess what y'all, I have to work. So I'm not gonna have time to do nothing, but I got a little change I'm gonna give to, you know, the people. I think stuff is too high for everybody to be paying for everything by themselves. So, got that. Okay, y'all, so, I got my weed. This is what I use. I got that $5.99, I believe, let me see. Yeah, $5.99. Yeah, this stuff costs $22.22. So, and I got my mousse because I needed that. And I got my gym, of course. Yeah, I got the one of these little oils. I had to take off the tag because y'all yeah, know they be, you know, Cussing. You have uh, bad words on here. It smells so good. This is something I can wear like to sleep. Oh, it smells really, really good. It, do. it really smells. It smells better today. Mm, it smells good. So, yeah. Let's soak this weave, okay? It feels so good outside. I got the window open. Letting that fresh air come in, okay? Yeah, so I got my apple cider vinegar. Boop. This, the Kroger brand. I'm not spending all that money. Girl, bye. <laughs> okay. Girl, bye. So, y'all, I got to clean this out. It's like a little bucket. I'm going to clean this out. And then I'm going to soak the weave in here. I watched a girl on TikTok do it. She did it for, like, she let her soak for hours. Then she washed it with shampoo and conditioner. What I probably do, yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I let it soak probably like two hours. Then wash it with some shampoo. Then I'm let it dry. I probably won't do conditioner and all that, you know. Sorry. So we're gonna see what comes off the weed. If it really is cleaning it, I don't know. I'm scared. If I mess this weave up, I'm gonna be pissed. So let me wash this out. So I got the apple cider vinegar. Let me turn this off for a second. I'm gonna put a little bit. I'm gonna put that much. Ugh, this stuff stink. Maybe a little more. I don't know. Oh, it stinks so bad. Put some water in there. I don't know if they did like cold or hot. I'm not really 100%. So. So, before I fill it up all the way, let me take this weave out. 
So I'm gonna keep the rubber band on. It's easy. It's going straight through. And I'm just gonna put it in there. Straight through it. These is bundles now, I'm just playing. Looks short. Okay, y'all. Uh, so I'm gonna fill it up some more. It's in there, it's good. All the hair is under the water, so I'm gonna put a little bit more just to let it really do its thing. So we're gonna come back and see if it's really cleaning it or not. Yeah, I'm gonna be fired up if it's for nothing. But yes, y'all, so we got that soaking. So I'm excited about that. Yeah, my face has been breaking off, uh, breaking out. I've been trying like these SPL 40 sunscreen. Every time I try one, it breaks my face out. If I eat ice cream, it's breaking my face out. Um, I have been eating a little bit of fast food. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Because last week I was just exhausted. I'm like, I'm not cooking. We both was just like, we not cooking. It's over. So. I did eat a little bit of fast food, yeah. So my face is breaking out. So that's probably what it is, honestly. But all the SPLs I have tried, they break my face out for some reason. I don't know. And I need a good face uh, moisturizer. Uh, I use the black soap to clean my face. So I don't know. But yeah, we're going to figure it out. But yeah, yeah, I'm at the finish working. And um, I'll come back to y'all. Y'all, I'm back. Nah, I'm just playing. Yeah, I'm working. I was trying to find something to watch. My girl, Alicia, just posted a video right on time. It's a vlog, I think. Yeah, it's a back outside vlog, period. So, I'm about to watch that. Look at, look at sis. Don't be outside cutting up. Into his word being what anchors them. Towards Jerusalem, he understands that if you are only used to me showing up in this, I just got done working. I didn't have to work that long today, but guess what? My vacation is about to start in five, four, three, two, one. Period. Bye. I'll quit. No, I'm just playing. Hey y'all, I done got dressed. I'm 
about to, I had to clean up after I got off. Y'all see my hair first and foremost? Is it not growing or is it growing? Okay. Y'all, my face is breaking out. All right here is breaking out. This right here, right here, right here. It was more like all this, like I had a uh, allergic reaction or something. Anything, like I said before, SPF, you know how they say you should use SPF 40 or whatever, SPF. So I got the Fenty, the big one. <laughs> got this. And it's the SPF 40 moisturizer or something like that. Mm. My face broke out again. I don't know if it's, I don't know. This is like my third SPF I done tried. I tried the Black Girl uh, uh, sunscreen. I tried like a regular one. And this is my third one. So I guess I won't be wearing sunscreen. But let me show y'all something. So you undo it. And then it comes out. Ain't that so dope for like a refill? She did her big one. If y'all hear my stomach growling, I'm starving. I gotta go to my family's house. Y'all know it's Easter. I gotta go to my family's house and eat in a few, well, in a second. Let me put my air rings on. I don't know. It's looking pretty good. Okay. Okay, do a little lash. I'm not gonna do no foundation since my face is breaking out, no concealer, no none of that. But I'm gonna do a little lash. <laughs> okay, we love a little lash now. Now let me find my stuff. Cause I think I'm gonna do a little eyeliner. Cause y'all know I like to put the lash on top of my eyeliner. I don't like to really put it uh, on my lash line, I guess. So yeah, I'ma do that. Alright. Yeah, I have too much stuff on my uh vanity. Yeah, my hair don't look bad. And, and if it frizz up, that's okay. But uh watch my film gonna be like, oh my god, y'all hair done grew. If you knew her, I did the big chop. So uh it's growing back. I had to cut the color out too recently, like what, last month. I cut the rest of the color out. I think I got a little bit in the back. I couldn't get that color. I think it was just drying. I don't know. You got to really take care of your hair when you have color. Yeah, my stomach is growling, okay? Okay. I did a little eyeliner. Let that dry. Fitbit on y'all because you know I get points and I need my gift cards. They gonna try to change the way you get the points now. Then we gotta work a little extra harder. I'm like, come on, y'all. But yeah, yeah, my hair. I don't know. I'm kind of proud of my growth because yeah, I was bald. Like I was really bald. For my lashes and I already wore these, so that's what I'm about to put back on. Um. Got them from Amazon. They are so, they some good lashes, y'all. Y'all definitely should try them. I don't know why I be singing. <laughs> I don't know. And they not long. I think I'm growing out of the long phase, y'all. I love me some big lashes. I do. I really do. But I'm really like a makeup. I do like makeup. I like the colors. I like it all. I like the blush i like the highlight under your eyes the concealer i just love it i don't know it's just it's, hmm. let me put my little duo lash i just put that on my lash line but yeah i had to clean the house i watched sarah jakes roberts this morning what was it called destruction it was something i watched earlier and um uh, it was really good. Sarah Jakes Robert, that girl right there. Use the Fenty, what's this? I don't even know, y'all. Fenty Glow. I don't know. I'm gonna use it. First I thought these wasn't like it. They okay. They they not too good. Uh I really don't know how I feel about that. I probably should have used a, uh, a clear gloss. 
But that's all right. Because we don't even, we going to eat with family. We ain't even about to be at doing nothing else. Y'all see how the lashes just do a little uff. Uh, right, my Chanel is. Ain't no more. For real. It's only a little bit. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Who ain't bad smell? Delish. <laughs> yeah, I just need to lose weight. That's what that means. Break The face breaking out because I'm big. Lose weight. Yeah, these are the glasses. And I got the little blue light, uh, UV blue light glasses. You know, if you work from home and stuff. I got these. Ain't they cute? Uh, I got three pairs for ten dollars, nine ninety nine, and then this is the other pair. Y'all already seen the black pair, so I ain't gonna show y'all that. Uh, ain't these cute? Yeah, they cute. I made it back home. Um, my package from TikTok came. So we about to while well, we're open up the package, but we about to look. Yeah, I got these little house shoes. Cause I just needed some. I didn't find none at Marshall's where I usually, you know, get my house shoes. Um they didn't have none in my size. So I got these little house shoes. This is too funny. Lord, let me see if I can fit. <laughs> they was like, you know, they'd be like five dollars. TikTok shop is so cheap, y'all. Uh they're little. Oh no, they fit. Okay. Yeah, I got these little uh fanny packs. Oh, I like the little clamp. You know what I'm saying? Like I can really put it on. It got uh, a zipper with like a pocket. Oh lower. Yeah. They got like a little pocket. Hope it's not too cheap and be falling apart and all that. And then a zipper. Uh, oh, they got little little pockets in there as well. So, yeah. And then I got the famous little $6 jacket. Because I need like a workout jacket. And y'all know this year, 2024, I want to show up for myself, period. So, I was like, I need like a little black workout jacket. $6. I got a, uh, hold on. An extra large. Y'all, we gotta try this on because I don't know. Let me see. Yeah, I tried it. Can y'all see this? Look how tight it's this little. It don't feel bad, but it's tight. But you know what? I'm gonna lose weight. Y'all need to lose my weight. Uh, cause I got a zero extra large. I feel like one X is be a little too big sometimes, but I probably should have got the one X. Um, cause they had zero extra large, one X, which I don't know if it's the same thing. I don't know. But y'all, they got the little thumbs, you know. So it's cute, but lower. Oh, I wish it had pockets right here. That'd been cute. But it's thin. It's like a spring jacket. That's what I needed, you know, when I'm walking or whatever. Just to get my little sweat in and all that. Even if I'm at the gym, I can wear this. You know, cover up. I want to be covered up, too. I don't want to be having everything out. Yeah, that's why I got from TikTok Shop. I got something else, but I can't show y'all because somebody's probably watching this and it's a gift for them. So I can't show y'all that right now. But yeah, I did give them a 10 out of 10. The material's nice. It's little $6. It's thin. It ain't nothing thick. So I like it. Girl, I got to lose weight though. That back fat is back fat ting, okay? So I need to lose weight. I might keep these. I might keep these for the trip. Put my little stuff in there. But yeah, can y'all see me? Hold on. Let me see. Oh, I mean, my waist a little big, ain't it? All right, don't embarrass me now. Okay. Y'all, my waist is still, oh my God, I gotta take it. Now that's crazy. 
Don't embarrass me like that, okay? I know I need to lose weight. But yeah, you know. Let me see if my phone can fit in here. Put my phone, put my little wallet, put my little thing in there, you know what I'm saying? Oh yeah, we in there. So can y'all see it? Can y'all see me walking? Have my little walking stick? Nah. But yeah, so I got that. So that's what I needed. And I need some more house shoes. I gotta go back to Marshall's because I like my cute, cute, cute house shoes too. But these is gonna do good. Y'all, yeah, they, they kind of like hard bottom. But they soft right here. But it's like a big cushion. Mm, we gonna make what it do, okay? I'll tell you that much. So yeah, I'm happy about my purchases. But yeah, y'all, thanks so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Give me a big thumbs up, please. Give me a big thumbs up, okay? If you like the video, comment below what you feel about the video. What's your thoughts? Let me know what's up, okay? But yes, my name is Kay Pretty. I do this for the big fan women that's on period. Like, comment, and subscribe. And come back to my channel. Come back to my channel, y'all, okay?